You guys were literally building this race car that looked like a spaceship. So what was that like driving over 3,000 kilometers in Australian desert in the Bridgestone uh, World Challenge? The race itself, it's a 3,000 kilometer race. Global teams from the top institutes around the world need to uh, be able to travel 3,000 kilometers only on a very small amount of battery and 80% solar energy. So it becomes a race of innovation. Obviously, just building the car itself it was uh, a challenge in itself. And then comes the race and you, and you realize that the true challenge is not building the car, it's testing technology to its absolute so on paper, this battery will last up to 100 degrees Celsius. But then you get into the race and uh, this happened about one hour into the race, like 100 kilometers from the starting line. Uh, I was actually driving the car and uh, the team is with me on the radio and they told me, don't look left. So when, when somebody tells you don't turn around, you, you turn, turn around. around. <laughs> yeah. So I looked left and all I could see was... Uh, uh, firefighters and ambulances and and my heart was racing because I didn't know what was going on and I saw one of the solar car teams and there was smoke and I later found out that their battery had failed under kilometers from the starting race and at that moment I realized that we're really testing technology.